Thanks for torturing me for 15 years. Now, will you stop following me down uh, Church Street? Pardon me, Wellesley East. So you're just going to follow me all the way down like you were coming out of there? Yeah, on a prompter and a wire. Mm -hmm. It must be getting very close for you then. Good. Good. So when I move this way, you follow me. Okay, so who's stalking who? I'm just walking on the street. Mind mind. Okay, well, what I'll do is I'll sit here. And you can walk wherever you want as an organized stalker and a criminal employee of the criminal government of Canada. Do you hear what you're saying? Yep. Do you hear the nonsense that you're saying? Yeah, you're, you're, that's called gaslighting. No, it's not gaslighting. Yeah, it's a see, word that you've made so we've, we've established now that I cannot sit here without you standing in front of me. No, we've established like. that I can't move this way without you following me. You can me. move anywhere you like. Okay, there we go. Yep, this is, this is what it's all about. Mm -hmm. uh, May 20th it is. Yes, don't forget to check your, check your watch. Yep. Check mine. 2.36 yeah. p.m. Yeah. and uh, 50 seconds. Yeah. Um, the hundreds of your drug buyers which have put into the uh, garbage bins for me with the Toronto Police, I'm very happy to expose them. I'm happy to expose you Terrorized as a... People. I'm happy to expose you Terrorized as a only. gay village cocaine and meth runner for 12 years running. You and a compulsive people. liar. You I'm glad to expose people. you as a compulsive liar from your hearing Terrorized records. Hear your hearing records expose you as a compulsive liar. You will never stop being a compulsive liar. My evidence will never be taken away from the internet. Okay? So you can have your uh, Jane Ferguson evict me. You have no power over me. You can stalk me around. You have no power over me. You are a cocaine runner and you're a crystal meth runner protected by the government of Canada and CSIS and the Toronto Police. Do you know what libel is? I, I, know, I know what facts are. And you if you want no to proof. sue me, sue me. Sue me. I have I have six have I tried to get you arrested you three right times. Right yeah, I, know I you tried did. to get you arrested three times and they three protect times. you. And three times you, the you stalking piece of shit. Not to worry about Of course, it. because the police are in yeah. on the drug running with you. No, you are a cocaine runner and a meth runner. A cocaine runner and a meth runner. And a cocaine runner and a meth runner will lie and lie and lie and lie and lie and lie. We've established that you're stalking me and I can't sit down without you doing this. You can sit down, sit down. Sit I don't follow your orders. So this is the government of Canada which runs cocaine and crystal meth. And this is a prime perpetrator. And I can't get away from him. You can walk, go ahead. Yep, it's have fun. Country. See you on YouTube. The same rights that I have. See you on YouTube. As a cocaine runner and meth runner protected by the Toronto Police. Rights. You have more rights than the Prime Minister. Still can't get rid of them. Well, we know who's stalking whom now, don't we? Let's try crossing the street. Uh, yeah, except this is stalking when I can't get away from you. You can't get away, you can just walk away. Trying to, five times now. Walk away! Look, man. Walk away. Look. I can't help that you're a state criminal. I can't help that you're a forgerer. I can't help that you're a forgerer, that you're an assaulter, that you're a male tamperer, and a compulsive liar. I'd like to report a stalker and a harasser. He's a Canadian government employee, and I can't get away from him. Yep. Yep. He's a uh, cocaine and meth dealer. He's a CSIS uh, agent. Look at that. Yep. Yep. Looks like I am. Yep, absolutely it does. Yeah. Go ahead.
Okay, so he's followed me down from church in Wellesley. Um, it's still May 20th, 2.42 p.m., 50 seconds by my watch. Um, you'll find this man uh, harassing, assaulting, and uh, forging my mail on that website. So can I exit the subway station without you following me out? As a protected, uh, I mean, dealing cocaine and meth for the federal government, you're protected more than Justin Trudeau, so, you know, I mean, I can't really help. You know, I mean, you're big at provoking scenes in public. I mean, I'm just trying to walk away. I can't really call the police. It's protected by 51 Division. I've tried to have him arrested. I can't get rid of him. So I was at day pass, yes? You want me to call somebody for you? Uh, well, the only people that will come are 51 Division, and he's protected by them, so I don't know what to do. Can you get security? Sorry, I'm trying not to shake. My blood pressure is just through the roof. Look, what I'll do is I'll take the subway, and hopefully I'll be able to shake him. If I can't shake him on the subway, I'll come back, okay? See, can't get rid of him. Let me call somebody. Hold on. This is someone who, who is invincible. being stalked by this man. Uh, I have internet uh, evidence of him running drugs for the Canadian government. Can't call the cops. He's protected by the cops. Usually when I get a, an incident like this, I'm actually followed by police. Oh, are you? Yeah, plain clothes who protect uh, organized stalkers like this. Okay. Okay, what I'm going to try and do is go around this way, and we'll see if I can shake him. Sorry. Right. 